Hello everyone. Today we will discuss about the writing tips for template. So when you will see any paper in respective journals in template format, you can see like this two column way they made it and how the figures they arrange here the figures and then somewhere you can see the full figure the figure will be like here one column on figure and the caption is one column on and then rest two column on. so this one if you will also download the template you will find also these two column on but generally students face difficulties when they will try to insert the images like this one images and here they will write this uh, uh, that caption uh, will be in one in a single column again then next two column will be there so particularly for this case generally students face difficulties so today we will discuss how you can sort it out how you can do it in word file generally when you will download a template from a particular journal and you will write then how you can do it very easily so that i will discuss and it will be helpful for every researchers those when you will write paper and you will insert images it will be helpful so let's uh, how we can do this one so uh, let's we will start on word file how we can insert these images and how we can make this two column on to one column on. so this one we will understand so now you can see i took one word file and you know if i want to make it one column on or two column on, but usually you will download this template from the respective journal sites which uh, um, journal uh, you are interested to write the manuscripts from that journal you can download the template and you can start but in general if you want to do also so you can see now here in any word file you can make it this one two column on, i made it but if you want to one column on, that very simple here you can see the column on, so in column on, if i will make it one then it becomes one column on. if you want to make it two column on, then i can make it two column on. so in this also in word file you can make it but now the problem like inserting image image like in between if i will make i will put a big image and how i will do it and then in the caption i will write in one column on like this so this one how i can how we can do it so this one uh, we will do now so now suppose i am interested here and another also i will show you the continuity suppose i am interested here from here itself i want to insert that image a full image I want to insert here then how I can insert the image here and then I will write the caption in a single low how I can do it so now if here I want to insert so definitely here should be some space will be there so now if I will insert in a very in that big image here it is not possible there is no space not possible so better I can continue here and how I can manage this space also that also I will tell you so now if I want to put the image big image here so I just uh, come here and then which image I want to insert that I will go for so now I suppose I will take this image so I just uh, copy the image and now I will paste it so when I will insert the image I just now paste it so now you can see I paste the image and so now i paste the image and uh, this image i will try to make it in front of text so you can see the image is very big so i will make it small little small yes so now here how i will make this one 
so I will put this one and then I need a caption for this figure suppose this figure is figure 1 so now suppose this figure is figure 1 figure 1 and this is suppose APSM the caption whatever the caption you want to give so same image of the samples Object from instrument. Suppose this will be the caption, but the caption should be then I should make it little long so that you, it will be more clear. A is D is so now so this is the figure caption so as you can see here figure caption should be in one column so first of all how I can make it this one column and then how I will insert it that we will understand so which one we want to make a single column so just try to select that then go for again page layout and go for column and make it one column so if you select a particular which one you want to make single column if that you select it then particularly that thing will be come as a single column so here you can see it came as a single column so now I want to put here insert the image so I just how much space I need for this so I will use that much space and now you can see I easily incorporate the image like in this format. So we can insert the image in the template. So if you want to insert the image, so this you can do it and you can insert it. So now another question, another that here some gap we observed so that gap how we can manage this one so for this gap how we can do it so that there will be no gap so for that you just take the cursor and make it and here just as you can see I click it here so here I will again go to this page layout and then here you can see some break option is there break just click on that break option and make it continuous this continuous you can see one option is continuous so make it continuous so now you can see here you will get a continuity so the gap you can't able to see any gap so these two tips will be helpful for every beginners those who want to so now you can see very nicely you made it so this too will be helpful for every beginners those who are writing their manuscript in template so it will be important for them so they usually they should know these two tips and in similar way also if you want to insert your tables you can also insert the table but if suppose you want only only one images like in this figure here like this then hope this you can see this is only in, in two cards this is in a column on it is itself so it will be not very difficult to insert this one so that's just you copy it and if you paste it here so then it will be inserted if you put it here then it will be inserted but the problem only comes when you make it and in a single column you will put it that time usually you mainly the new beginners they face the problem when they write it in a template so hope 
this video will be helpful for all the new researchers those who are writing their manuscript in template format usually if you use when you will submit a manuscript and you will write it in, in their template and you submit then it looks more attractive compared to if you write in word format and just you write in word format and you submit but if you write in their template then usually it looks good so when you usually use when you will use templates then this type of problems may arises may comes so you can easily sort it out so thank you very much for watching this